The Walther PPK is well known as James Bond's weapon of choice. It's classy, and it packs down to the size of a suit jacket. It's compact enough to bring to a wedding in your pocket. In any case, this episode's weapons are not like that. This episode is about Dirty Harry Callahan's Go Ahead, Make My Day, Great of Destructive Power. Go ahead, make my day. We're talking about Kentucky bourbon here, not shaken dry martinis. We're talking about the mighty hand cannons. Headshot. Let's check five of the biggest and baddest of these weapons. Our first gun was nominated for Handgun of the Year in 2002. The BFR, an acronym for Big Frame Revolver, and not any unprintable slang, or maybe it is, is a single-action five-shot revolver produced by Magnum Research. It is made from stainless steel and chambered for a number of very powerful pistol calibers, such as 500 SNW Magnum, as well as several calibers traditionally used in rifles, such as 30-30 WCF, 450 Marlin, and 45-70 Government. Yes, we are talking about rifle cartridges in a revolver. This is not a standard revolver converted to a heavy caliber. This gun is designed and built as a heavy caliber handgun and will hold up to the test of repeated and sustained firing. The BFR has an imposing size and heft, as it weighs between 3.6 and 5.3 pounds, 1,600 and 2,400 grams, depending on the model and barrel length. The BFR is available with varying barrel lengths ranging from 5.5 inches or 14 centimeters to 10 inches or 25.4 centimeters. With a maximum effective range of 200 yards, this gun is known for its exceptional accuracy and durability, making it an ideal choice for big game hunting or long-range target shooting. This next one is Deadpool's gun of choice. The Magnum Research Desert Eagle is a gas-operated semi-automatic pistol known for its distinctive design and powerful chambering options. Developed jointly by Magnum Research in the United States and Israel Military Industries IMI, the Desert Eagle was first introduced in 1982 and has since become a sought-after firearm among collectors, enthusiasts, and movie fans. The most recent model, the Mark 19, is available in a 7-round capacity in 50 AE and 8-round capacity in 44 Magnum. The gun measures 10.75 inches or 27.3 centimeters in length with a 6-inch or 15.2 centimeter barrel or 14.75 inches or 37.5 centimeters with a 10-inch or 25.4 centimeter barrel, available in black as an aftermarket item. This gun weighs approximately 72 ounces or 2,041 grams with an empty magazine. The Picatinny-style accessory rail easily allows for aftermarket optics and scope rings. The 44 Magnum, popularized by the 1971 film Dirty Harry, where Clint Eastwood's character famously wielded a Smith & Wesson Model 29, remains one of the most potent revolvers to this day. While the 44 Magnum cartridge can be chambered in various firearms, the Smith & Wesson Model 29 and Model 629 are among the most iconic and revered. With one of its most powerful loads, the 44 Magnum will drive a 304 grain bullet to 1325 FPS, generating 1,188 foot-pounds of energy at only 36,000 PSI. The Smith & Wesson Model 29 weighs between 41.5 ounces, or 1.177 kilograms, and 45 ounces, 1.276 kilograms, depending on the barrel length and configuration. Its fame has also led to its inclusion in various video games, such as the Fallout series, where it is known as the 44 Magnum Revolver. The Smith & Wesson Model 460, chambered in the powerful 460 SNW Magnum cartridge, is a versatile and powerful revolver. The 460 Smith & Wesson is not only a very high-pressure cartridge, but it's also extremely efficient. It'll scoot a 260-grain bullet out the barrel at an amazing 1900 FPS and generate more than twice the energy of the best 44 Magnum load. This one will hit you like a freight train. This is a really big gun. It weighs 72 ounces and has a barrel length of 8.38 inches. The barrel alone is larger than some guns. The revolver is built on the company's largest and strongest frame, known as the X-Frame, and represents a joint effort among Smith & Wesson, Hornady, and Corbon. The Ruger Super Red Hawk, chambered in 454 Castle, is a force to be reckoned with, delivering massive energy and stopping power that rivals even the most powerful handguns. It is one of two of the hottest loaded, by chamber pressure standards, revolver cartridges of all time. 
It uses all 65,000 PSI of its chamber pressure to push a 325 grain, 45 caliber bullet to 1,525 FPS, generating 1,678 foot-pounds of energy and a power factor of 495. In layman's terms, it will knock what you are shooting at into the next century. The Ruger Super Red Hawk's robust design, featuring a six-shot cylinder, is built to withstand the pressures of the 454 Castle round. This revolver's power and adaptability have earned it a place in various video games, such as the Resident Evil series.